I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. <laughs> Storm cloaks, Imperials, dragons. Ain't no matter to me what I kill. Let them come. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Did he now? Huh. The man is persistent. I'll give him that. I suppose it's time I give him an answer. Roventus, what do you make of all this? If Ulfric were to attack Whiterun... As in all things, Lord, caution. I urge us to wait and see. Pray wait. I'm of a mind with Ireleth. It's time to act. You plan to march on Windhelm? I'm not a fool, Proventus. I mean it's time to challenge Ulfric to face me as a man. Or march his storm cloaks up to the gates. He'll do no such thing. A dagger in the back is all you could expect. He was rather straightforward with Torig. Torig? He simply walked up to the boy and murdered him. That boy was High King of Skyrim. I'm not the High King, but neither am I a boy. If Ulfric wants to challenge my rule in the old way, let him. Though I suspect he'll prefer to send his storm cloaks to do it for him. True. He's already proven his personal strength. Now he seeks to prove his armies. Then might I urge you to consider General Tullius' request? I mean, if you are bent on offending Jarl Ulfric. Ulfric is the one who has offended. But Proventus has a point. Ulfric has made it clear. In his mind, to refuse his claim is to side with the Empire. And what harm is there in letting a few legionnaires die in place of your own men? It seems cowardly. Was it cowardly then to accept the White Gold Concordat? This again? That was different. Was I given a chance to object to the terms of the treaty? I've made up my mind. Even if my advisors are still squabbling, I'm sending you to Windhelm. You can return this axe to our friend. The esteemed Jarl of Windhelm has my answer. Make sure he gets it. The chests of gold didn't hurt. Damn it! This isn't about gold! Lord, wait. Let us see if all three is safe. Hear the news? Speak we with Ulfric. I'm not sure why He's Tullius is wasting him. The man was wrong about him. You're right, Galmar. Again? I'm in no mood to joke. Give the word, my lord. And Whiterun is yours. Whiterun is only a means to an end. I've toured our camps. Speak with Ready. Ulfric. He's expecting word from Whiterun. You are. Is any man ever ready to give the order that will mean the deaths of many? No. But neither is every man able to give that order when he must. But you are that man, Ulfric. You've been that man before, and you'll be him again. And these men and women, they call themselves storm cloaks because they believe in you. They are the meanest, toughest sons of bitches Skyrim has to offer. And they want this. They want this as much as you do. Perhaps they want it more. 
You're certain we're ready. White Run's army will no doubt be bolstered with legionnaires. And those walls around White Run are old, but they still stand. We are ready. And I might be old myself, but I'll kick those damn walls down with my bare feet if you would only ask me to do it. Ha! <laughs> and I'm sure you could do it too. All right. This is it. Yes! Send the word. A new day is dawning, and the sun rises over Whiterun. Aye, and the sons of Skyrim will greet that dawn, teeth and swords flashing. So it begins. Make haste to our camp in Whiterun. I want you on the front lines. I have a feeling about you. Your place is on that battlefield. I need you there. Fight well or die well. Talos be with you. The Empire thinks it holds Valkyrie from us. The souls of Skyrim's fate. For a dragon to attack Heinsgrove? Why? Why?
Raising my own sword. Protect the Yarl when you're alive! <laughs> Everyone stand down. That's an order. Stand down. Down. Battle proof. Vignar Greymane. Your family was noticeably absent from the walls. Now I know why. Wouldn't the dagger in the back have sufficed? You think this is personal? The Empire has no place in Skyrim. Not anymore. And you, you have no place in Whiterun anymore. A convenient position to hold now. But mark my words, old man. In the days to come, Ulfric will spread his rebellion thin. And what then? We need the Empire as much as it needs us. We Nords are the Empire. Our blood built it. Our blood sustains it. You of all people should know that. This was my empire. I'll be able to worship whoever I damn well pleased. You wish to see an empire without Talos? Without its soul? We should be fighting those witch elves, not bending knee to them. The emperor is nothing more than a puppet of the Thalmor. Skyrim needs a high king who will fight for her. And Whiterun needs a Jarl who will do the same. Tell me, Vignar, was all this worth it? How many of those corpses lining our streets wear the faces of men who once called you friend? What about their families? Enough, both of you! There is a burning city out there that needs a government. He's right. Galmar, come. Let us restore order. This isn't over. You hear me, you old fool? This isn't over. And you, a storm cloak. I thought better of you. You'll all come to regret this day. Get over to Vendhelm. Tell Ulfric of our victory here. We've driven the Imperials out of Whiterun. This is good. Very good. We now control the center. It's a powerful position. One I aim to keep. We'll call you Ice Veins now. For the thick blood of our land has seeped into your heart. Here, take this. It's an Imperial officer's sword. A fitting weapon to use against our enemy. I suspect you'll be of greater use to us with greater freedom. So you're free to engage the Imperials as you see fit. But I also want you to find our hidden camp in Falkreath. Galmar will have special tasks for you, and will need you when we liberate the capital. You'll be doing whatever Galmar tells you to do, and causing as much mayhem as possible for the Empire and any Jarl who supports them. Go with the gods. 
I've got your back. How can I serve you, my Thane? Lead on. Feeling sick? Got some good peace out here if you're looking to buy. More inside. Don't forget. Check inside the shop if you need anything. We've got small weapon. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage? Good doing business with you.
Some say that Thalmor grabbed him. It wasn't long before I found myself under Ulfric's banner. Some say Ulfric desires to be king and nothing more. Have they not seen that his anger floats on a sea of tears? You're going to Fort Newgrad. They have some of our boys locked up there. But with a little luck, we can turn that to our advantage. I've sent some men to scout out the area. Meet them. See if you can't find a way to slip in, free our men, and take over the fort. They'll never suspect an attack from the inside. This won't be easy, but that's why I'm sending you. You got the grit to get this done? he is willing to die for. Open.
tell you what. You start running so I can stab you in the back. Don't think. Well, hell well. Look who it is. How have you been? Good to hear. I need this to go well. This is my first real command since they promoted me after White Run. You know, some nights when I close my eyes, I see the battle stretched out before me, like I'm still there. To the men you've killed. Haunt you? Mine do. I suppose you're right. They say it gets easier. I'm not sure if that's a good thing. But never mind all that. We've got a job to do. We found a cave under the lake. With luck, it'll lead into the prison. I need you to sneak in there and free our men. Killing anyone inside as you go. Once you've rescued the prisoners, head out to the courtyard. We'll stand guard out here, and rush in as soon as we hear fighting. Should be fun. You should wait until nightfall before trying to sneak in. Talos preserve you. Can't wait to kill another Imperial.
There's more of them somewhere around here. Let's go! 
I don't want some snotty elf telling me what gods I can and can't worship. Ah, thanks. I thought I was going to rot in here. So, what's the plan? What's the plan? What's the plan? Great work. Get back and report our success. I'll stay here and clean up the mess. What's the plan? Glad you were here. Couldn't have done it without you. I bet we have rabbit again. I'm getting sick of rabbit. <laughs> Go tell the... Keep your Dialogue. eyes open. Feeling sick? Got some good pieces out here. Looking to buy. More inside. I don't claim to be the best blacks. The finest weapons and armor. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. I'm proud we liberated Falkreath from the Empire. In many ways, it's the heart and soul of Skyrim, not to mention its rather strategic position. Some brothers have taken to calling you Bonebreaker, evidence of your ferocity and determination, a fitting name. So we shall all call you thus. The war demands so much from us, and we give all we have to it and to the people. I've kept a little something to offer you in appreciation. Please take this on behalf of all the brothers and sisters. And I need capable and loyal warriors close at hand. So I'd like to offer you a home in Wenhel. Speak with my steward, who made the arrangements. Get over to our camp in the Reach. They need every able body they can muster. Take care. I'm not much of a strategist, but Lord Ulfric listens to my counsel all the same. Travel safely. It's dangerous out there.